and to recognise the mark that the women of Dagenham have had on our world. I think, um, I think that is the point, right? In, in many societies, it doesn't matter where you are, it's very easy to sometimes compartmentalize or silo this idea of International Women's Day solely being about women, but it's not, it's about all of us. So thank you so much for having me. It's really a privilege to be here. Thank you. And I'm just so proud to be able to witness so much of this activism and this energy that you have in this room because it's it's how we are going to see the impact in the world that we need. It's all of your voices, as you said, and, you know, being able to feel empowered to use that voice. So well done. You guys are going to do great and do the best. That's very. Oh my god, that's Megan. I'm actually gonna meet Megan. <laughs> She's like my biggest idol, so it was the best. Um, at first, when she came out, I could see her hair, so I thought it was going to be Kate. But then when I saw her face, I was like, oh my god, that's Megan. I'm actually going to meet Megan. So yeah, I was really happy. I feel like an empowered woman is like undefeatable, do you know what I mean? And knowing that this Duchess, a royal person, wants to empower me and Renee and all women around. It really allows change to be made in the world. I know it's International Women's Day, but just for everyone to remember that there's women out there who are strong, independent, do so much, and um, it's important that we remember that.